What's up guys, it's Mike from Jersey Connect and today we're gonna take a look at the new Boston Celtics Earned Edition jersey. So basically, if you made the playoffs last year, you get new gear to wear this season. And if you've been paying attention to the NBA games, the Boston Celtics have been wearing this new jersey colorway. It kind of looks nice on TV. When I talk to people, it's either hit and miss. But in today's video, what I'm gonna do is unbox the jersey, take a closer look at the finer details, and hopefully help you decide if you wanna purchase this or pass on it. If you guys find this video helpful or entertaining, an easy way to support the channel is just by hitting like if you want to hit subscribe. And then we also have a notification bell so when I drop new videos, you don't miss out. So let's go ahead and unbox this thing. I picked up the Jason Tatum version of the jersey. I mean, he's going to be the star for Boston for the foreseeable future, unless they mess that up. But I bought this at Hibbit Sports. And here's the first look. Boom. All right. So. Not the prototypical green that you usually see on the Boston Celtics jerseys. They went with like a little lighter green, also a darker kind of like olive colored green. But let's go ahead and take a closer look at it. Starting off at the collar, you get that prototypical green that the Boston Celtics usually wear. But right in the middle, you get this highlighter or neon green that runs through the middle. So you have it on the collar and the arm openings and on the earned edition jerseys. What's really dope about these, they're actually stitched down and they use a hard plastic material, similar to like the Nike swooshes on like Nike shoes. But you can see how vibrant and how it shines in the light. Looks really dope. And we go to Jason Tatum. So right here, pretty standard, just nice and heat pressed, really clean. And then we go to the zero. You got that green base with the white trim, all heat pressed. And when we look at the actual polyester base, is it olive or forest green? It's like a darker tint of green. Something different compared to what the Celtics usually wear. And that is the back of the jersey. On the flip side, you got the same type of deal. You got the green and you got the highlighter green, neon green that runs through the collar and the arm openings. Then we go to the neck label. So usually the label would be like smack dab right in the middle, but since it's stitched down that NBA logo, they kind of have to put this off center. So this is a size large. And retail tags, NBA authentic, dry fit, standard fit, 130. And when we go down to the Nike swoosh, really beautiful, that silver swoosh, also stitched down on these earned edition jerseys. And then they have that hard plastic similar or pretty much the same material as the NBA logo in the back. Then we go down to the lettering. We got Boston Celtics, green base, white trim, all heat pressed. And the numbering, same thing, all heat pressed. But the jock tag is a little different on these earned edition. So it's silver. You got the Swingman 48. Same information, same like style, just different colorway. Then you got earned edition. You got nothing on the side panels, but that is the front of the jersey. And this is what it looks like when you wear it. So I'm 5'6", 170 pounds. Um, I kind of fluctuate between medium or large. If I want something more form fitting, I'm gonna go with a medium. If I'm gonna go with a large, I kind of want to wear it with like a hoodie or something baggier. You see there's some chest room here. So it just depends. Um, I would stay true to size on the jersey if you're gonna pick it up. It has pretty much the same sizing as normal Swingman jerseys. But this is a front view of the jersey right down here. We got the side panels. It's a pretty solid green jersey right here. Side panel, then you got the back. And that's the jersey. The response online is kind of like hit and miss on these jerseys, but it's actually nicer in hand than when you look at it like shopping online. But not too bad. I'm not like high on the jersey, but I'm not low on it. I'm kind of indifferent. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. I don't even know if I'm gonna keep the jersey to be honest. So if you guys are interested, check out our eBay store. I may list it on there. There's gonna be a link in the description below. So this is a size large again, so. I don't know. I'm feeling, eh, I don't know. We'll see. But thank you guys for watching and on to the next video, guys.